My grandpa gave me a call and told me there is a creature in my trash can hissing at me trying to attack. Guys, there's a possum. Where is he? He's right there. Oh, oh look my at look at this guy. goodness. Look at him. Guys, we've got our possum here. Let's get him in the trap right now. One, two. What is up, everyone, and welcome back to the channel. I hope all of you guys are having just an absolutely amazing day. For those of you that are new to the channel, well, I'm Jacob, and welcome to my jungle. Now, this isn't my jungle. This is actually my parents' house, but if you've been here for a while, then you know I used to film here. I used to live here, but now I have a five-acre property in Miami full of tigers and lions. Well, not tigers and lions, but leopards and sloths and lemurs. Anyways, that has nothing to do with today's video. Today's video, I was actually over at my grandpa's house. My grandpa gave me a call and told me, Jake, you need to get over here. There is a creature in my trash can hissing at me trying to attack. So, of course, I hopped in my car. I ran over over to my grandpa's house and well that is all I'm gonna tell you so if you want to see what creature we pulled out of his trash can well guys you are in the right place and we're gonna hop right into that one hour later so we just got over here to my grandpa's house and I've actually filmed I think two videos here um, a long time ago we haven't filmed here in quite a while and like I was telling you guys before my grandpa called me he told me there is a possum in his trash can who the heck knows how that happens you know possums are scavengers so they will scavenge through trash cans, through trash mounds. Oh, and there he is. Oh, hey. The yeah. man. Grandpa, how I'm you doing? I'm sure glad you guys showed up. Yeah? Well, I'm, I'm glad I'm here. Here, give, yeah. me, give me a hug here. Yeah, man. It's good to see you. Yeah, you know, so, I, I I got a problem. That, yeah. And I told you about it over the telephone, but I couldn't explain it the way I wanted to actually show it to you. Because yes. I wanted to tell you that okay. uh, I heard a noise over in my garbage can uh, this morning and I was afraid to go in to look in there yeah. uh, because we do have animals around here and I mean you know possums are are pretty common so are raccoons yeah and we also have a few foxes living around the back here I think I'm not wait, sure wait wait you think there's a fox under well that might that, that wait well, where show me show me where well guys the, from uh, what my grandpa's saying there could be a fox but where well, do you, there might be a fox living here yeah well you see back here uh-huh it's kind of dense oh guys they yeah like, they like to, to be in you know they like to be uh covered with something they don't like to be really outside yeah and i underneath my shed there is a perfect place for them to bed down and have babies and everything so you think it's, it could be underneath the shed oh so and, this is and he gets in and out over there there's a big hole over there but i Let's don't want to show it. it to you now but the, he gets in and out of there and, uh -huh. and, and roams the neighborhood and i guess comes back uh, before I wake up and he's back underneath there. So I'm not sure if uh, If he's there now, I don't hear or nothing. Wait, so you think he's getting in from this spot right yeah, here? Yeah, I think he's getting in from underneath here. It's a big, big area for him to crawl under. And, and Okay, so we're gonna check that, but you said there might be a hole over here. Should we go this way? Well, I don't know. Uh, if you want Let's to. Let's go, yeah, because but, maybe... But, but you gotta there's... be careful back here because I, I got a lot of junk. Yeah, guys, as uh, you can see, this is his man cave back well, here. Well, I mean, there's all this junk and stuff for my boat. And, uh, I don't know. Uh-huh. Let's see it. And the sometimes, old... sometimes I see paw prints on this oh, deck up here. So that could be from a raccoon or even yeah, a possum. Yeah, I think they might be getting up and getting into this boat. So, do you think they're... That there really could even be one hold on there's a little ladder here so by what my grandpa's telling me there could be a pot a fox or a raccoon or possum living in his boat guys let's hope this ladder doesn't break on me one two okay well we're checking the boat right here now all right he would be where what do you think up in the cabin well, probably, yeah there's a spot he could probably get out of the weather and everything up in the uh, up in that cabin do you think he could be up in the cabin well it's a very good possibility because okay but i haven't actually Seen him around the boat, but I've seen okay. paw prints. Paw prints on the boat, so yeah, I'm gonna. You know, in this dusty area, they leave paw prints. Yeah. So I'm gonna check it out right now. So guys, I'm gonna check in the cabin. There could be I, something I, in I here. Really want you to do is find out what the hell's in my garbage can. Okay. Yeah, we gotta do that. So again, we are not here to check the boat. We're here to get this whatever's in the trash can. So whatever's in the trash can, we gotta take care of that. But we got a, a little sidetracked here, checking out if there's something living in this boat. I, you know what, we're gonna come back maybe later on today, maybe another day, and we're, we're really gonna check the boat out. But yeah. I'm curious to see the shed. Hold on, I don't wanna fall here. Yeah, be very careful, please. Yeah. Because uh, it's, it's a big step down. Yeah. You want this? 
No, I got it. Oh, guys, I almost got it. One, two. Okay, right, we made it. it. All right, so. All right. Wait, let, wait, I want to look under the shed first for a second. Hold all on. Right, well, look Let's see. The shed and see if there's anything under there. I don't know. It's awful dark under there. Yeah, I can't really see a whole lot under here. Yeah. I'm not seeing much. Okay, well, I'm not seeing much under there, but. Well, you know, there's all kind of weird things around here because it is kind of dense and, and messy, but yeah. something in that garbage can make it. Okay. Something, noise. something in the garbage and can. I looked in there, and I, there's a possum in there, and it was, yeah, he was hissing at me like he wanted to bite me. Oh, so, so I, I mean, that's why I called you, because I wasn't going to get next to that. Yes, yeah, so wait, wait, Grandpa, wait, wait. So, I'm here now, yeah. but I would love to see you grab it. And catch oh, it. no. No? I don't know about that. Okay. I mean, they have teeth, and... You know they're wild. They're crazy, and they will bite the heck out of you. Oh, they sure will. And I, uh, I don't need any more scars. Yeah, <laughs> I've got enough scars on me after 86 years. 86 years. Grandpa's going strong. 86 years. Yeah, well, it I is. I love this guy. It's close because I got grand grandkids like you. Amazing. Yes, indeed. Watch out now. Okay. What I wanted you to, to look at is this this possum okay. over here. Maybe. Maybe. In this uh, garbage can because okay. it was making a lot of Well, let's come noise. take a look. Let's see. And I'm afraid to look in there because he was, it was okay. I, I glanced in there and was hissing at me. There he is. He's in there. Guys, there's a well, possum. Where is he? He's right there. Oh. He, a possum yeah. in the truck. Oh, he's showing his teeth. Look at him. Oh, look, look at, at him. That. See, look I, at knew, him. I knew that Guys, thing was look, kind of wild. Look at this. He's showing his teeth. Now, so he must have fallen in here because this was left overnight. Now, did he rip open the trash bag? I don't know I don't, what he did. I don't think so, but... So, oh, I think I, I got something on my finger. Wait. Oh, it smells really bad, guys. Something something from the trash. Something from the... I got to wash my hands. Something from... Uh. So... How should we grab him? He doesn't. He doesn't look that aggressive. Hold on. Let, let me try and touch him real quick. I wouldn't do that. Actually, Why? I think maybe you better get a net. Well, maybe we should. But let me see. Watch it. If he turns around and bites you. So one thing about possums, guys, is they have a fully prehensile tail, and so they can actually. He's fake and sleeping. That's why. They, that's why they call them possums. Oh think. my. Okay. Maybe we should. Maybe we should get a net before we touch him. So. Maybe we should get a net just just in case he takes off. We need to have a net nearby right. so we can scoop him. But well, again, let me, let me get my net. Okay. I, I well, got a net. Get your net. On a minute. All right. Grandpa's getting his right net. Back. So we're over at Grandpa's shed. You never know what you're gonna find in his shed. Oh, we got a net. Yeah. Well, we got several of them, but. This one here seems to be the better of the, the, the two. Okay, yeah. let's see it. Well, here we is. Nice. I this... think I think that'll be a uh, big enough net to take care of the. Uh, yep, I possum. think so too. So we have this big net here. So just in case the possum bolts on us, we'll be able to chase him down, swoop down, and catch the possum. Now, actually, I think we should do it this way, this flat bottom, just like this, because otherwise well, there's a gap. So, you want to do it. so. We've gotten this far, but we haven't thought, are we releasing him or are we going to take him to a nearby preserve? Well, I thought you were going to take care of that for me. Well, do you have a trap? I think I do, but it's back in the back. We have to okay. find it. So guys, we're going to get over there. We're going to get, we're going to get this possum out of the trash can. We've got our net. We've got to get our trap and get this possum out. Yep. So I see you got the trap. Good. Yep. That's, that's that's probably what you're going to need to, yep. so, to transport this thing exactly. out to the, the woods or wherever you're going to take them. Exactly. So this is our trap here. Now, this is a trap meant for catching an animal. So I'm not sure. Okay, wait. This works by... Oh, I, don't, I haven't used that trap in a long oh, time. Oh, I see, so. I see, I see, I see. So, guys, basically what we got going on here is this trap is uh, open because we're going to have to grab this possum and, like, swoop him into the trap. So... I think, oh, he's showing his teeth. Come look at him again. So I think... He's going to sleep already. Look, you you hold the net. Grandpa's going to hold the net. I'm going to pull him out by hand, and I think I'm just going to put him in the trap. Yeah, well, he's playing possum. That's what they call him, possum. Yeah, so guys, let's go. So again, the possums have this fully prehensile tail, so you can actually hold them by their tail, oh my goodness. and it doesn't hurt them. Oh, oh look my at look at this guy. goodness. Look at him. Guys, look yeah, at this he... crazy possum right here. Wait. Hey. I have the net on standby. Crazy possum out of the trash can. Absolutely insane. So we've got our possum here. Now, guys, let's get him in the trap. Because he's got these big canines ready to crunch and munch. Grandpa. Hey, wait a minute. What? I don't need to touch him. Wait, it's a new pet. Well, not for me. Why not? You got to take it out to the woods and let it okay, go. Okay, so guys, we've got our possum here. Let's get him in the trap right now. One, two. Okay, right, he's in the I'll trap. Look at that. Sleep. The possum is in the trap. There he is. Mission successful. Hey, and well. 
Yeah. Live and well. Guys, we got the possum right out of the trash. What do you think about this? Whoa, Crazy. take it easy. <laughs> hey, he's a scary little rascal. <laughs> he's a scary <laughs> rascal. We got to take this guy, and we're actually going to release him nearby at a, right. at a rock pine well, land listen, preserve. I want to thank you guys for yep. helping me out of course. here. Of course. I would have never been able to do this on my own. Yeah, I'm so glad I was able to come here today, help my grandpa yeah. out, and get this crazy possum out of his trash can. And well, that's going to end today's episode. I hope all of you guys enjoyed watching today's possum rescue. Guys, uh, if you enjoyed today's video, make sure to give this video a thumbs up. If you want to see more videos with me and my grandpa, he's taking off. Well, guys, hit the subscribe button, tap that little notification bell, and you'll be notified whenever I post.